Hello. Hi. Follow me. Being able to share experiences is one of the best parts of a relationship. <laughs> I don't know what's behind me, bro. <laughs> nothing. There's nothing. I told her she's not allowed to look back. It took us seven years to share this one. How are you doing? Good. But I want to look back already. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, send there. No, look the other way. Ah, I love my eyes. Should I open them? Open them. <gasps> See? That's what I mean. Whoa! San Francisco? <laughs> Whoa, I didn't expect that. <laughs> Ooh, to talk about. Wow, it looks so pretty. It's like New York, bro. <laughs> it's like New York, bro. <laughs> Let's move here. This is where we belong. <laughs> Aww, I am so happy. The first time I came to San Francisco was nine years ago, in summer 2012. Actually, it was the summer that I met Joss. San Francisco became my favorite city, and in the seven years that we have been dating, I've told her a lot about it. And now, we finally made it here. I planned the next four days with one goal in mind. I wanted her to like it as much as I did. And so far, it didn't look bad. We're in San Francisco. We've been walking around for like one hour. And Joss has already said four times, oh, we should move here. Oh, it's so inspiring, it's so beautiful. <laughs> Everything looks amazing. And I already got two compliments. Oh yeah, two girls already told her. Nice outfit, girl. Yeah, and the other one told me, you look great. Yeah, because Joss was walking like this. Like a model. <laughs> on the street. Babe. Do you want to move to San Francisco? Yes. Yeah? But we need more money. We need to be earning five times what we earn right now. We have to work in Tesla or Apple or Pinterest. And do you want to move here? I've been here before. I was waiting to bring Joss to San Francisco for so many years. <laughs> and now I finally achieved it and we're here. Yes. I'm happy about it. I also love it. And I think. I'm gonna fall in love with it just as much as Janice. Actually, to get her expectations a little bit lower, mm. it's not even that great. Uh, great. It's like pretty ecky, pretty whatever. It smells like pee. Nothing <laughs> interesting here to see. Look at that. Mm -hmm. You can play tennis in the middle of the city. We're moving on. Even though I don't want to, I want to stay in this park forever. <laughs> There's so much more to see. Okay, let's go. The walls are looming, keep caving in on us. Welcome to Union Square. The waves keep forming, keep crashing in my thoughts. When the time's right, oh, when the time's right. I know where we can eat dinner tonight. Cheesecake Factory! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh my god, we haven't been there in years! <laughs> and that Cheesecake Factory is where I ate 2012 spaghetti pesto or something like that. And you threw up! And I threw up. <laughs> and all the pesto came out again. I was like, oh man, <laughs> what a waste of money. It came out from both ends. And now we're going back to relive that moment. <laughs> We would come back the next day, but until then, there was so much to see. Starting with... Oh, Chinatown, is it? Yes. <gasps> it looks like China. <laughs> Man, this city is so nice, guys. Every time we cross the street, we're stopping in the middle to take a photo very fast because everything looks like a cool place to take a photo. Let's go to Chinatown. Ni hao. <laughs> So 
Hubei. Now we came from Chinatown to Little, Little Italy. Italy. How do you know? Because there's an Italian flag there, another Italian flag. How do you know? So it looks very Italian. Teammates, now we're gonna go to the place where all the people are waiting. No, <laughs> it's gonna take like an hour. Hopefully they're worth it. Of course I did my research beforehand. According to the internet, this was one of the best pizza restaurants in town. Whoa. What the hell? Weird. Why would they do that in the middle of the day? Scary. I'm freaking out. I was like, are we under attack? Is that normal? <laughs> this pier became one of our favorite spots in San Francisco and we would come back to watch the sunset behind the skyline the next days. It's the second day. We're out and about again. And now I brought Joss to another famous place here in San Francisco. It's the same place as yesterday, no? <laughs> Are you ready? Yes. Okay, open your eyes. Wow, wow, it's not where we were yesterday. <laughs> Nice! It's not as high as yesterday, but it looks super nice. Do you know where you are? No, where am I? Wait, do I know where I am? Wait, wait, wait. The houses. The houses are famous, are they? <laughs> where am I? In San Francisco. You don't know it because you haven't watched the series. It's Full House. It's Full House. <gasps> so these houses are called the Painted Ladies. And they're famous because they were in the opening scene of the Full House series. Mm. And now we're in the park in front of it and there are a lot of people. Apparently it's a place where all the young people hang out. Like us. And this park is called the Alamo Square Park. So if you're in San Francisco and you're a Full House fan, or you just want to see these cool houses and take a photo in front of them, come here. Come tend the garden with me. We have so many seeds to sow. These are the painted ladies. <laughs> and I'm here with my lady. Uh. Ta da! <laughs> <laughs> but I'm noticing lately we've been half hearted. West Side Story don't feel pretty, don't feel pretty anymore. Okay, Joss. Okay, Janik. You are. In a new part of the city. Yes, correct. Do you know where you are? I am in the high five zone. We did it! Yes! <laughs> Welcome to the Golden Gate Park. Whoa. What? Is the Golden Gate Bridge nearby? Not that nearby, I'll see something uh. in the teeth. Uh. So this is the beginning of the Golden Gate Park. And do you know what? Tell me. This is bigger than the Central Park <gasps> in New York. Really? Yes. Whoa. Oh, I cannot wait to walk in it. It's super nice. But the thing is, it's pretty cold. And I'm wondering if we should come back tomorrow. <laughs> but look, everybody's wearing shorts and I don't understand it. Okay, we can walk for five minutes and then we go back and come back tomorrow. Yes. Okay. Our time in the Golden Gate Park was short but nice. While everyone around us seemed to be wearing less than us, we wished we would have brought even bigger jackets. Which we actually did the next day, when we came back with full-on winter jackets. But at least now we know what Mark Twain meant when he said, the coldest winter I ever spent was a summer in San Francisco. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? Very good. Nice. Ducks are coming. In this area, there, everything is silent. There's a bunch of dogs. It's a dog. Pow, 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 pow. This is a nice break from our busy schedule. Oh, 
just had dinner in the Cheesecake Factory all the way on top of the Macy's building and the view is amazing and it even gets better now that it's getting dark because you can see all the lights from the buildings around us. Silver night. Whoa, your glass. <laughs> <laughs> this is our last full day in San Francisco and it's gonna be the best one because <laughs> the best things are yet to come mm. it's the best weather today the last two days it was pretty cloudy and pretty cold and now look at us yeah finally summer is here so we're at our first spot mm -hmm. it's right over there okay Let's go. yes okay How come everybody's here? Because of the viewpoint? No, because of the street. Oh, I know where we are. I know where we are. Yeah? Yes. Inside out. I, I don't know if it, <laughs> it's in inside out. It's is a street it? that is like this and they are uh, in traffic and then the anger gets all angry. That's true. The street is called Lombard Street. Wow. Pretty much all the cars that drive down this street are tourists. Yeah. But I've heard that the people that actually live in the street are super annoyed by the tourists. Wow, looks like a garden. You know, when I saw this street um, in the movie, uh -huh. I thought it was so ridiculous. I was like, oh my God, they're, they're acting like San Francisco looks like that in real life. I thought it was just exaggerated, uh. a weird street. I didn't know it existed in real life. Well, wow. now you know. Yeah. I think I know why the street is like this. Why? because it's so steep. It's not steeper than these ones. That's the reason, look it up and let's I see if I'm asked. correct. So the homeowners of all of this area, the neighbors, uh -huh. decided that the street was too steep. Like <laughs> Just said. like I said. Yeah, <laughs> and they wanted to make it rounder. Mm. And now they probably regret it <laughs> because everybody's probably. taking photos there. Wow, look at the cars. Wow, should we rent one? Okay, ready? For the next spot? Yes. Okay. I know as the daylight grows how I am supposed to feel. Azkaban, dude. Azkaban. Alcatraz. I always confuse both of them. I could swim that. Yes, sure. I can swim that far. Yeah. <laughs> Are we gonna go to Alcatraz? No. We sadly didn't get tickets for Alcatraz. Because they're sold out completely. Not totally. So if you come to San Francisco and you want to visit Alcatraz, then buy your tickets on time. Unlike Jenny. Welcome to Fisherman's Wharf. I love this place. It's amazing. You guys have to come here. <laughs> I hear animals. <gasps> oh, they're here. <laughs> Did you look around here already? No. Oh. <gasps> Golden! Golden! Wow! For the first time, dude! <laughs> so within a few minutes, just saw the coolest things of San Francisco. She saw the sea lions, Alcatraz, and the Golden, Golden Gate Bridge. Yes! Yes! I'm killing it today! <laughs> now, maybe we should eat something. And then we're gonna walk. Maybe we're gonna take a bus a little bit closer to the Golden Gate Bridge and then we're gonna walk. Yes. Last time when I was here in 2012, I crossed the Golden Gate Bridge by foot. That was amazing. He's super cocky about it. He's always showing it off to everyone. So maybe we should do it today so I can say the same. Maybe we should. That day I actually walked from downtown all the way to the Golden Gate Bridge across it and then it took me six hours. 
six hours, dude. You were like, I can walk that far. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going to eat something. We're gonna have Thai food. This restaurant is awesome. This is not sponsored, but <laughs> it tasted so good, so I can totally recommend it. Just now, when we are arriving to the Golden Gate Bridge, there's a cloud covering parts of it. There was one more thing we had to do in San Francisco, to cross the Golden Gate Bridge. But the sun was already setting and after walking the entire day we decided it was better to come back the next day. With new energy and hopefully no clouds. Well, that's kind of a bummer. The Golden Gate Bridge! <laughs> or a cloud! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we present the Golden Gate Bridge. Yannick has been waiting for this for years to bring me here. And now it's a big, huge fail. You can barely see it. <laughs> but it's still an, a unique experience. Yeah, we're gonna walk across the bridge now. Maybe from the other side it looks better. Hopefully. <laughs> I guess now you saw everything you needed to see for your first visit in San Francisco. Nice! I like it. I like it a lot. We took one last look at the bridge and then our time was up. We never got to see it without clouds, but I'm sure we'll come back. Because it looks like Joss has fallen in love with this city just like I did nine years ago. And while we would have loved to have a couple more days in San Francisco, we weren't too sad we had to leave. Because our trip through California had just started. The funny thing is, at that point we had no idea it would become one of the best summers of our lives. Well, one of us didn't know it yet. 